Hi you guys, so you are watching another episode of Bring That Bonnet Back. I feel like I have a lot of catching up to do because there's been a lot that's been going on. You know, last time I really spoke to y'all, I was just starting back to work. So I'm in the midst of getting the girls life together. Shut up. Because we are about to go to Sam's Club. Now there is a lot of things going on like I have mentioned for the hundredth time and I don't have a tripod right now so let's bear with that. So we are going to go do a mini grocery shopping trip because we are running out of food and we need that to survive. So some of the transitions that's going on right now is that we are in the midst of changing the girls rooms in our house. So. What is happening is, one, I have mentioned on Instagram that I bought the girls a playhouse for their birthdays that's coming up. I am in the midst of trying to do a makeover of that as well as kind of upgrade some of the toys and different things that they have. And I don't want to show you right now, but we have the day bed. The day bed has to go because the playhouse is actually gonna go in this room. And since the playhouse is gonna go in this room, we don't have a lot of space for other things. So I decided to do a whole different kind of makeover to the room. So on top of that, Nala is in transition of getting out of her crib into a toddler bed, which I have started filming that process. She's not officially out, but that is something that we're planning on doing tonight. Tonight should be the first night that we both gonna sleep together in her toddler bed so that, you know, we can start that transition. So I end up doing a floor bed. A floor bed is more of a Montessori approach. That being said, we're also transitioning a lot of things in the house more Montessori. Now we're gonna do our own blend of Montessori. So if you ever hear me say Montessori things, I am a beginner, okay. But I am also a believer doing things that works for you. So I think we're gonna take a lot of Montessori approaches to things, but not 100%. So that being said, a lot of the toys set up, everything is essentially about to change. So. It's gonna be chaotic, but I'm just updating you. While I am here talking about some of the things go, like I said, this is leaving. Um, I don't know if we're gonna sell it, put it up, hide it, I don't know, but I'm thinking, but all I know is it can't be in here. And then we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do about Noel too, because Noel is also uh, close to growing out of her crib in a sense of how tall she is getting. Uh, she's already on the lowest level and she is still kind of peeping over, which is really fine. But I think that if we're going to take a lot of the Montessori approach, that means that she needs to have her space to the same way that I'm setting up Nala's. I'm trying to make the life decision if I want to allow her to take my computer room do I want to put them in a the room together, which is something that most likely won't happen because I don't think Nala is mature enough to be in the same room as Noel. So I'm debating if I want to temporarily give up my room to Noel, but all I know is the crib got to come out of the playroom and the day bed needs to come out. David didn't say hi to y'all yet. Hey, I'm black. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, y'all, what's up? It's angles. Mm, no lighting. Yeah. Nah, LaBelle, you ready to go? Yeah, shoes on. Mm hmm. She ready to go. Yeah. Hey. Hmm. So, we're back. To be genuinely honest, I forgot about y'all. We already started doing some grocery shopping. We already, uh... Seems like an everyday occurrence. Mm-hmm. Oh. Do I want pink lemonade or regular lemonade? Oh, that's raspberry. Oh, that's a good price. Yeah, it's only $3. Can't help but get a good deal. 
so this is what we the shopping cart is looking like so far plus the lights down here david is hoping that we don't spend much but be, be gentle please i don't know be gentle i don't know i got five on it five i got five on it <laughs> five. that's it <laughs> oh i could do ten I mean, that's a little better. So y'all see that this cart is slowly building. It's getting heavy. Mm -hmm. Slowly building. My wrist hurts. <laughs> what are you talking about? What are you talking about, huh? What you? You see yourself? <laughs> Silly girl. Look at them in this little twin thing. I love it when store just get sleepy. You get sleepy. Something like getting sleepy. You get sleepy. You get sleepy. So if y'all look at Nala's hair just in case I ain't explained this before. I am in the midst of actually braiding hair clearly. So I'm in the midst of braiding hair right now, so that's what it's looking like. But I have to do the other side, so just in case, that's why her hair looks messed up. I only did the top. So I still gotta like braid the back. She got her little hairs back here and stuff. But your girl's getting a little bit better at the braiding tip. Yeah, you did it braiding. Oh, you think so, babe? Yeah, you did. Oh. Thank you. David's also over here scanning. Scanning. This makes it so much easier. Mm-hmm. If y'all not using scanning go, what are you doing? David's scared, I already see it. I don't even want to look at <laughs> what it's totaling up to so far. I told him I'll give him ten dollars. Jesus. Stressed out. Scanning too much stuff. So y'all, we are officially back in the house. We been in the house probably like a good 30 minutes maybe yeah so now i am in the midst of contemplating if i still want to test out the whole bed thing with no nala or if i just want to wait until tomorrow i'm trying to figure out the only thing i need to do is take everything off her shelf put in a closet and just put the security box on the cord and that's it and we have all that stuff right you have the security box mm -hmm. yep she's not asleep Let's go look at her and her thing. She is getting cozy, but she's not asleep. We have finally gotten a place where we are putting shorts and stuff. I'm sorry, this is not a good... <laughs> what do you think I should do, David? Are you ready to be sleeping with her? I think I'm indifferent. But you also gotta think about this. Um, are, you gonna, are you still gonna be getting up for Noel bottles and stuff? No, I'm gonna say no. I feel like I won't be able to see the room unless the crib not there. Should I just go see now what I can see? Sure. So sorry. So sorry. So sorry. Okay, you got the plug in ink player in. And then you just gotta hold it up for what I can see. Gotta check this out. So, don't do that. Don't do what I'm doing. Don't do this, baby. No, 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 don't do that. Uh, uh, no. Put your leg down. Bad idea. Bad idea. Put your leg down. Y'all want to show the bed. Look at it. Look at it. Yep, just the bed and my foot right there. <laughs> Trying to get it focused yet, just the bed. So if we need a wide angle camera. If it was over here, it probably would only show partially the bed. Mm hmm No baby. No Nala. <laughs> Is it in Zoom or no? No, it's not in Zoom. There's actually another fire alarm right there. Yeah, just... <laughs> <laughs> so, from that angle, it's not much better. Like, you see, like, it's a little bit. Better. You see, like, a little bit more in front of the bed. Mm -hmm. You actually see the whole bed. It's still like need more. 
So you can only see that if she got out of bed. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh no, it's definitely gonna make her think to climb it. Look at her. Don't do what your mama's doing, okay? It's not okay. Don't do what your mama's doing. Unsafe. Very unsafe. Terrible. Terrible. Terrible example. Terrible. Terrible. Lay her down. Make sure she knows to go to sleep. Go to sleep. Put a blanket over. Night night. Give her a bottle if there's still something in there. Uh, Alright. Let's go. Let's go sneak out. Bye. Oh, the light. No, not the light. I don't I don't want it. It's dead without it being on the charge. Oh gosh. Okay, hold on. We can do this. We can do this. Turn it off. Turn it off. Okay, it's off now. Okay. What's... Yeah. It's not probably a good idea. It's probably the first time that she realized she can try to climb. Mm-hmm. She can get her leg way up there. You see how high we got? Shoot. So now we definitely got to <laughs> take her out. She going to jump out of the crib and onto the bed on her own without us. I wonder, <laughs> I probably should put that security thing on the doorknob now, just in case we in sleep in the middle of the night and she fall out. Oh, regret. We just, we'll just keep an eye on her. I think once she sleeps, she'll be knocked out. So you put that over the doorknob so they can't get out? Yeah, so it's like loose over the doorknob. So they, when they twist it, it would just rotate over the door. And you gotta right. actually push these in. Yeah, luckily she don't even know how to twist twist out of the door yet, so this kind of catches her before she even learn it. Yeah. Mm. Go to sleep. Let's see how it came out. Done as I want, even though it's a little crispy. Quesadillas in the air fryer. It's a little crispy though. I like it crispy. But I want it a little bit more crisp. Yeah, throw that thing in that some more time. You've done this before? No. <laughs> you talk, you're over here talking <laughs> like you do this all the time. <laughs> no, I don't know who's <laughs> ever done it. I heard those people doing it. Uh, Raven, she said she put hers in the air fryer, so I'm like. It sounds like she put everything in her air fryer. She literally did. <laughs> so I don't know y'all. To be continued, I guess when tomorrow comes, you know, we'll see how it goes. It's probably gonna be added to, to this video. Whatever we decide to do. We gotta eat, drink something, put your thirst, talk about it, and then see what's the best decision. So I guess we'll see you in the next clip.